Good morning Year 3, so today we're going to do your spelling test for this week. So as always I'm going to read through the words, um, I'll repeat it twice and then I will write them down at the end and then you can tick them if you get them correct. If you don't, I want you to spell them correctly and have another little practice of them, okay? So your first word for this week is actual. It was an actual disaster. Actual. Your second word is believe. I believe in fairies. Believe. Your third word is exercise. For my daily exercise, I go for a walk. Exercise. Number four is describe. I want to describe the dragon. Describe. Number five is guard. The guard stood outside of Buckingham Palace. Guard. Number six is interest. I have an interest in trains. Interest. Number seven is occasionally. Occasionally, I play outside with my friends. Occasionally. Number eight is particular. I am particular about my classroom. Particular. Number nine, probably. I'm probably going to go outside today. Probably. And number ten is strange. It felt really strange when I walked outside. Strange. Okay, so just take a minute to just have a look through your spellings. Get your grown up to read them again to you and just check that you've spelled them correctly. And then I will go through them on the board. So, your first word was actual. And actual is spelt A-C-T-U-A-L. Actual. Number two was believe. B-E-L-I-E-V-E. -E Number three is exercise. E X E R C I S E. Exercise. Number four is describe. D E S C R I B E. Describe. Number five is guard. G U a R D. Number six was interest. I N T E R E S T. Interest. Number seven was occasionally. O C C A S I O A A L L Y. Number Eight is particular. P A R T I C U L A R particular. Number nine was probably P R O B A B L Y. And number ten was strange. S T R A N G E. So just take a moment to have a little look through those. If you have spelt them incorrectly, write them correctly next to them and have a little practice at them and have another test next week, okay? So let us know how you got on with your spelling test this week.